but okay, so we defeated the hardest boss for last. It was funny. But yeah, and hell, like... Like, hell, like... Uh, I love Attack on Titan. It's such an expertly crafted narrative. But yeah, I, I, ho I, I, I'm, I'm guessing you weren't planning to watch the show, child. Yeah. Yeah, I watched like I think up to. Uh. Fuck, I think like the season end of season one of the anime and well in the manga. Yeah, that's as far as I've gotten. Cause that's as much as that, that was at the school when I was at school. So. I see. Fair. Why, why is fighting weak to fly? That's weird. Flying poison so I kick a bug. Because flying is quite literally one of the biggest advantages to a fighter. Fair point, yeah. In nature. Like, it doesn't matter how strong you are, if the enemy can literally just fucking carpet bomb you with pecs on the head, you're either going to get out of there or die. Or nuke. Get nuked. Yeah. That's another option. <laughs> Birds with nukes. Tactical nuke. Tactical bird nuke. Isn't that just when they take a shit and then it lands on you? <laughs> <laughs> God damn. Apparently you have to be really unlucky for that to happen, like it doesn't happen often. Well, if a oh, bird yeah, like... in some places if bird shits on you, it's good luck. Hmm. You know what? I'm happy that they can think that positively. I, on the other hand, will literally <laughs> fist fight the bird. I will fist fight the bird. <laughs> How are you gonna fist fight a bird? They don't have hands. Exactly. That's just called assault. I will assault the bird. I will assault the bird. I will assault the bird. But yeah, and like, another, like, uh... I, I think about, like, these dumb criticisms of Attack on Titan needlessly common. They've got, like, that weird little section of my brain that I fixate on. Partially because it's my favorite anime, and I think partially because, like, I'm constantly trying. Like, I genuinely, if someone can reasonably demonstrate that Attack on Titan is problematic, even as my favorite anime, I am more than willing to fucking acknowledge it. It's just every time I see someone saying it, it seems like they've never actually read or watched it. Like, they base it solely upon a handful of Twitter threads. Rather what than actually on what's in the text of the show. What happened, right? I was chasing a Chansey, and it just vanished. Yeah, those that happens. I had I was chasing two Chanseys, and they vanished. Yeah. Yeah, and like... Like, hell, for, for example, like, the main arc that everyone... Uh, every one of these sorts, like, acts like is, uh, yeah. I forgot to put my phone face up. I will be up in a sec. I have butter. Give me a second. I need to go grab supper. No. Fuck you. God, I love Eerie. I'm I'm getting ready to fight her, and she's just I don't want to fight her. She seems so nice. Oh, there's a fucking chancy. Can't outrun me now, bitch.
right now I'm trying to get uh, Lemon to level 48 so that I can evolve into Garchomp. <laughs> then I'll take on the last okay. leader. So Team Star has has uh, tattoos, right? That they are a part of Team Star. So, oh god, that's level 54. Jesus Christ. Um, but so my question comes: Does that mean like what are they gonna do when Team Star falls? Like, are they gonna get it off? Like the 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 thing off? Like I don't. What are what are, what are they going to do? What do you mean? Well, they have stars. Like, tattooed on their bodies, but it's very obviously the team star... Like, mark. So, like, what the fuck are they going to do? Maybe keep it and just be friends afterwards? That's my point. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, like, the grunts and shit, though. I return the cheese sticks. No. Can I have a cheese stick? Sure, come to Colorado. Okay. Five, Christ, oh five seconds God. later, Hatcher just hears a knock on her door. Yeah. <laughs> I'm knocking on the door, Hatchet. Let me in. Let me in, Hatchet. Say the password. Cheese sticks. That's not the password. Eat Fail. shit. No, that's also not the password. <laughs> Motherfucker. Oh, that is the password. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I'll go let you in. Thank you. No. Okay. Bright said no. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Bright's your parent. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna disobey that. <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, there's just a bunch of ghosts just sitting there. What the fuck? <laughs> What's with that haunting? Right. What? Right, what what level was team the, the fairy team at? They were all level fifty. Mm. So maybe I think the fighting and the fairy are at the same level then, because I'm at the fighting one right now and it's level fucking. The grunt was only level fifty four, and I'm like, Jesus fucking, what the fuck? But yeah, like, it just hurts my brain. Because, like, I think that the fourth season of Attack on Titan is the most demonstrative of how, um, how interested the narrative is to criticize the cycle of violence. Because it quite literally bounces back and forth between the perspective of Eldians who are under the thumb of outside powers and Eldians within the walls. And directly... Like, literally one of the major character arcs of the first section of the fourth season is a character, like a child, being de-radicalized from a fascist position. By literally just talking to the people that they're told to demonize. <laughs> right. <laughs> Why am I afraid? Bookwork couldn't see me post that, so I, I wanted to make sure they could. Is Brent muted? No. Oh. God damn it. I forgot I had the <laughs> equal sign. I forgot I had the equal sign as my damn fucking mute key. God damn it. Where did you press the equal sign? I don't know. I apparently got pressed. Well, I guess that is a good, good mute key to use. You're never gonna use it otherwise. Unless you do math. <laughs> no, that's the point. What do you mean, bookworm? I no, don't know your child. What, what do you mean, child? That's that's the point. Bright doesn't do math. Good point. Fuck you. I mean, are we wrong? Yeah, is it wrong? 
Yes, I can do math. I've had an A for math at every single school, you son of a bitches. Okay, then what does I in math represent? Imaginary number? Yes. <laughs> X and Y, what do they represent? Hey, hey, Brian. That depends Brian. on the type of math, Brian. Right. What? If you do math, then why do you constantly say things like infinity plus one? Because I'm an idiot. Yeah, and idiots don't do math. Fuck you. Blockworm, defend me. What the fuck? Would Bookworm defend you? Bird alert. <laughs> Since Bookworm. Imagine the hypocrisy of, my, of me saying that. <laughs> Why? You can be an idiot and good at math. <laughs> Thank you, Bookworm. Mm. Provide an example. That <laughs> shit. Lemon wants to learn to move. Dig. Provide an example of someone who's very dumb, but also good at math. Ah, uh, you? <gasps> Hatchet. I ain't good at math. Lemon's evolving. And, and I also contest the idea. No, Bright is not. I Well, Bright <laughs> is dumb, but Bright is not good at math. Yes. Bright is good at math, but you just don't believe in her. You started this rabble with me. Don't turn what? sides, you fucking traitor. Anyway, Garchomp Unless is the mock Pokemon. The protuberances on its head serve as sensors. It can even detect distant prey. Oh, it's six foot three. Big boy. Large Even though that's boy. actually really fucking small for a hammerhead. The middle wants to learn to move crunch. <laughs> Each boy crunch. Also, okay, so I know like technically the team star where you have to run through it and shit. It's a it's a bit laggy, right? But it it still works. How are you supposed to uh, yeah, why do they give ten minutes? That is a lot of time. As children. That, uh, yeah. Yeah. This is a children's game. Now all my team members are fully evolved. Mine, my, my oh god, why did one of my Pokemon die? How the fuck did they die? My party's been fully evolved for a while. Granted, you didn't have a pseudo-legendary at the time. Good point, yeah. <laughs> Well, anyway, I think no, I don't think they count as a pseudo legendary. Who? Also, Jesus Christ. Uh, Lapple. No. Yeah, no. Well, they are the they they are the region's dragon type, if I remember. Well, no, the pseudo legend is the dragon type, and that's the uh, shoot shoot boy. Daddy, shoot me, cat out of your cannon. I love blood force trauma. Also love fo blunt force trauma. Yeah. I love Eerie. You love Jiri? Eerie. Eerie. E R I. Oh, wait, Bokram, you didn't say. No, I realize most people talk about different things about good at math. You can't be. Good at math that you learn in school, and good at math on a special interest level, says Bookworm. True. Oh. Though, Bookworm, you never did answer my question about the statement I posted. It's true, right? I don't, I'm not hearing anyone decline it, so I know it's true. That's how that works. not how that works. <laughs> it is now, bitches. It very much isn't, but okay. I don't know right. what logical fallacy that is, but it's definitely one. 
Actually, you know what? I don't know if I and since I don't know the actual technical term for that logical fallacy, we're just going to call it the the bright fallacy. It works. That works. Also, eerie, eerie in in. Oh my God, she uses heel balls. That's adorable. Oh my God, I love her. I love her. Oh. <laughs> What the fuck is that? A Nile uh, hape? What the shit? Oh, that's a new form, isn't it? Jesus Christ, where the fuck did you get this? I ended one shot. Jesus Christ. What the fuck is that? How the fuck do you get that? Oh my god, what the fuck? Right, prepare for the the fighting one, because I think this one might be harder than the fairy one. Too dear. Okay, thanks. Then again, the, the one day I had fair, I probably would be fine with the fighting one because I have a bunch of Pokemon that can deal well with fighting. It's mm -hmm. just I didn't have a lot to do with fairy, so you probably didn't have a lot to deal with fighting. And you probably have a good amount to deal with fairy. Yeah. Can I climb that tall ass mountain? Yeah. And you have a ghost type. Oh yeah, that's true. Jesus Christ. Yeah. This this goddamn dog, bun dog, is tanky as shit. We must climb Anyone... this mountain. Uh, I'll switch for Lucario. Lucario is... Steel fighting, if I remember correctly. Lucario's in a lot of maybe I've seen. Hatchet. Yeah, there, yeah. No, Lucario's in a bunch of Pokemon movies. It's actually really cool. No, that's not what Hatch was talking no, about. No, Hatchet, Hatchet's obviously a big fan of the Pokemon movies. I don't know what the fuck you're on about. Yeah, I mean, I... I love those Pokemon movies. Yeah. See? Exactly. See? Hopefully, Ar Aris can sweep the fighting boss. That's fair. Like, I really love that one Pokemon movie where, where like, one of the female characters in Lucario, they, uh, they, uh, uh they have a fight. <laughs> I don't remember that movie, but that sounds fun. <laughs> it was a very, very fun movie. It's imprinted on my cortex. <laughs> I see it How at all times. Happen? How did that happen? I, I don't know. know. Maybe I sat too close to, to the screen for some reason. Pokemon movies for adults, says Bookworm. I hope this is fucking dog. Daisy the Gourmet, because I have a little title for her. Well, now I don't have to worry about this. Because the evolution to the dung beetle, you literally have to have it follow you for a thousand steps. Yeah, that also goes for the smiley fucking thing that you have on your team. Yeah, and this I is the only one I have to... Fun. This is the only one I ha uh, don't have that has a thousand step evolution. So... Um. So I just gotta kill it. That did not do much. Okay. Oh. Cat shark. So I've decided that the five cat sharks I will be adding are uh, chain cat shark, coral cat shark, uh, the pajama shark or the striped cat shark, the izu cat shark, and the file tail cat shark. I like the fact that <laughs> I like the fact that the striped cat shark is also called the pajama shark. Is it? That's cute. Yeah, P Y uh, J A M A. 
Oh, what the fuck? They got a shield? That's some bullshit. Seems fair. Oh, there's a four star. Let me check a pronunciation for the pajama shark. Pajama. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's just uh -huh. pajama shark. <laughs> Everyone loves them pajamas. It's the pajama shark. And they're really fucking cute, too. Flying is good against fighting, right? Yes, okay. I've noticed something. Uh, uh, making these cards while you're streaming, I'm making more cards than I would if I wasn't trying to make cards. But it's super fucking slow. Because I'm so distracted. Fucking... Okay. Come on, guys. You just gotta keep hitting them. Why am I not attacking? I should have, I should have made this thing um, better fucking flying type move. God damn it. Well, yep, there it goes. God damn it. Ugh. Fuck. Yeah! I have two. I got it. Now I don't so have done. to evolve the, the shit bug. The, the dung beetle used, uh, dysentery. Oh, you need a dysentery? You might want to go see a doctor, <laughs> child. <laughs> you, you don't have dysentery? No. No. No? Oh. I don't drink from 18th century wells. I do. It's very, it's a very fun hobby. I 100% I recommend. You're an idiot. That's you! Says hey. you, Bright. Says you. Hey, at least I don't consume things that get me killed. Alcohol? I mean... What? I don't Alco drink enough to kill me. Yeah, but it slowly kills you. Shut up. Also, I love how... I love its, um... Pokedex entry. An infant sleeps inside the ball. Rapska rolls the ball smo soothingly with its legs to ensure the infant sleeps comfortably. Oh. It's a dun be it's a dun beetle, which means Oh. And <laughs> bookworm. <laughs> Life slowly kills you. <laughs> yeah. Well, unless you don't live a life. Now what? I'm sitting in my mom's basement, talking to a bunch of fictional people in my head, while searching up pictures of sharks for a shark card deck. Yeah, I have no life. Oh, that's a life. Nah. Nah, this ain't a life. Well... Yeah, a shark card deck you will only share with the people in your head. <laughs> well, I can't. See the cards. I see you're almost at the fifth base. Hold up inside there is Team Star's last remaining squad. You fought well to make it this far. Thank you, Aaron. 
I like it. It's Clive. Oh. <clears throat> um. Fuck. Character, character, character. Um. Absolutely. Uh. Absolutely. Aaron. Caught. Cat. Cannoli. You good? Oh. Aaron. Cannoli. <laughs> this surprised face. So you made it as well, Clive. See, so you can see his face is the principal. No, I actually can't. The screen's too small. Oh. Why is the screen too small? I extended Because it. I'm... Because, oh. No, it's because I've, like, resized it to be about the size of... Um... The... Stream chat window. The majority of my screen is taken up by sharks. That's fair. Sure is a hell lot better than what you're doing. <laughs> of course. It's the last base. I would want to miss out on the action. Live. I owe you my thanks. Your help has been invaluable for the operation. I'm sorry I was wary of you at first. I have a cheese stick in my mouth. No. What do you mean, no? <laughs> I mean, no. What does that even mean? I mean, no. Yeah, what does that mean? What is intended by that statement? Just no. <laughs> if you don't give me an explanation, I'll put the other half of this cheese stick in my mouth and make you wait longer. It means you can't eat cheese sticks. Fuck you. This is a free country. <laughs> is it? Sort of. Just Not no. really, but it's free Barely. enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the American way. It's free enough for me, okay? <laughs> Well, that's all water under the bridge. I forgot that I'm doing a male voice rather than a female voice like this. When we're finished with this base, will there be the end of... Oh, fuck, excuse me. Operation <laughs> Starfall. The, that's the end of the, uh, the sentence. Oh, 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 fuck, excuse me. <laughs> I don't know why I find that funny. Why do you find my burps so funny, Bright? I don't know. Does this mean that to Bright Peak content is a, a mouth fart? Yeah. Maybe. You are a child. Shut up. Anyway. Right has the mentality no. of a child. Shush. No, 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 that's the point. Right, right is a child. Child, you have been upgraded to slightly less than adult. Mm. Right is downgraded to child. Yeah, anyway. There can only be one child in the server. <laughs> anyway. Not quite. We'll still need to handle Team Star's secret mastermind, last of all. Do we have any? I, 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 I. Do we have any leads on how to find them? Uh, right. Yeah. Sorry. Uh. I'm hoping they'll come out in the open once all the squad bosses have stepped down. I stay. We've come so far. Only a few more steps left. Don't let me down, either of you. And we tried so hard. And we got so, so hard. And in the but end, in the end, 
It doesn't even matter. Constantinople hung up. Constantinople. <laughs> <laughs> Is that I even, love the name. I don't think there's a place anymore. Is it not? No. no. Well, it it is technically, but it was renamed to Istanbul. Yeah. God damn it. It was the previous uh, capital of the Byzantine Empire. Then they got and taken then, over. And then and then the Turks came in and, and named it Istanbul. God damn. Constantinople hung up. All right. Yeah, that's actually one thing that surprised me. I didn't. I didn't realize that the Ottoman Empire survived uh, to World War One. Oh yeah. I mean, it was on its deathbed by then, but yeah. And fun fact: it's the way that the West reacted to sections of its dissolution. That led to the modern, a large aspect of the modern instability in the Middle East. Oh, damn. Great. Because basically they promised a rather progressive sect of Islam. Military aid and fighting off a more regressive sect of Islam. And then they just didn't give their ally support specifically i think it was the uk and france they just didn't give them support so they got uh superseded uh this clan uh was later changed if i remember correctly the name was either at the time or was later changed to the house of saudi which you might know uh which might sound familiar because the land that they took over is Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia. Yeah. And, like, on top of that, you know, like, later instances such as uh, the CIA consistently Thanks, coming Book in and Worm. bulldozing democratic elections to favor Western corporations. If you didn't know, like, one of, like, literally the first democratically elected, uh, at least if I remember correctly, the first democratically elected leader of Iran was, uh, assassinated and then replaced with an American puppet. Because he was just a little bit too friendly with the Soviets. That's, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Long story short, CIA is evil. I feel like everyone knows this. Yeah, no uh, shit. Well, everyone except for them. The people who uh, <laughs> really like getting under the desk for the United States government. <laughs> I'll not yeah. say anything else. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Let's that's see. It. Thanks to you, Aaron Bright, I've slowly but surely come to understand Team Star. Is he gonna take the fucking, the fucking pompadour off? Wait, Vocal I know is... what I need to do. Oh. I know what my final decision will be. Vocal says even they potentially know it, just are are okay with it. Yeah, probably. Very likely. Kind of like how uh, it's obvious that folks like, uh, oh, I forget the name, like Mar Margaret Taylor Green, whatever. Margaret Thatcher. Uh, no, not yeah. her. Cur current person within the sa state or the House of, House of Representatives. Like when... Trump's Mar-a-Lago home was fucking rifled through. She starts comparing it to the way that the FBI treated MLK. You know for a fact that if this was literally any other person, they she would just be completely A-OK -okay with the FBI bulldozing someone. Because mm -hmm. these people never actually question governmental powers until they're slightly inconvenient for them. 
Yeah, didn't he? Wasn't he caught stealing some like nuclear things from the U.S. government or something like that? Uh, yeah, some of the documents pertained to locations and security at, uh, I believe, nuclear power plants. I don't remember if there was, like, nuclear weaponry. Yeah, and he thinks he can run again for president after he was caught with that. Well, depending on how well his legal team manages to fare, maybe. But the idea is basically to get him on, like, a federal charge, and then he can't run. Uh, so let's hope that the January 6th hearings go well, as as they've already been going very well. Like, yeah. Trump's legal team is basically just, their only option at this point is stall for time. Just stall for time. Please let us stall for time so they can get president again and fucking, fucking hand out a pardon for himself or some shit. Please. <laughs> Please, just give us more time. We'll find the evidence. Please. Can they actually do that? Like, pardon yourself? I mean, I don't know, but... I mean, it's just sure as hell more likely to work than whatever the fuck they're doing in the hearings. <laughs> uh, sorry for getting all impolite there. Don't know what came over me. Goodbye, and Clive. they just leave. They have a flat ass. Why are you looking at an old man's ass? You wouldn't? Why aren't no? you looking at an old man? <laughs> wait, wait, he walked away and he statement. walked back. What wait, the fuck? What? You are pretty skilled. Not many trainers shrug off my Pokemon's attacks like that. Fuck, every time I put a cheese stick in my mouth. <laughs> Same to you, Ari, was it? She can rewind people. Oh my god. That was a dumb joke. <laughs> this is what Ariel will look like when she's grown up. <laughs> no. Oh man. Oh man, the glow up. Where'd her horn go, though? <laughs> uh, she ate it. That, that's where her quirk comes from. <laughs> Obviously, all that no quirks exist in this universe. Um, or do they? Yeah, how do they you don't. know? What if the Pokemon's abilities are actually just highly derived quirks? What happened? I mean, there are some Pokemon that used to be human. Sorry, what if? Okay, fan theory. The, the quirk singularity doomsday theory. The idea that quirks will get more and more complex to the point where humans can't handle them anymore. What if that causes all the humans who have quirks to revert to animal-like creatures, and then the people who don't have quirks end up showing up, and, and the people who had quirks were Pokemon? <laughs> and they just Boom. start catching Please, them in I balls. Think, I think... I think we should go get Hatchet's medicine. <laughs> I already took it, bitch, and it's why I'm like this. <laughs> Please stop taking your medicine, then. Anyway, Hatchet, <laughs> no. go ahead. I need my fish oil. <laughs> <laughs> the same to you, Ari, was it? Your Pokemon have clearly spent a lot of time honing their moves. But I'm surprised to find the boss herself out here defending the gates. Don't you trust your grunts enough to put them on guard duty? Watch your mouth. I'm here because I don't want to risk anyone else getting hurt. That's all. What a benevolent boss. Now, if you want to get on with our battle, I'm already on your side, on my side. You know, on what would be side. funny if, if Ari actually did speak like the voice I just gave them. <laughs> if they spoke like that. Like, like do, you mean, yeah. do you mean like My Hero Academia Ari? Yeah. Little Ari. <laughs> yeah, she started speaking super demonic. 
Just like... I was... Really sad you got her. I didn't know your name. What I know Lamillion's name. But what's yours? <laughs> that would be amazing. I want a fan dub to be just... Only Ares' voice changed. And it's just that. <laughs> that would be amazing. That really would be great. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's gonna be a double battle? Who are you? The first second I thought Clive said, Who are you? <laughs> that would have been funny. <laughs> it's just like, Wait, do I know you? <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm really showing my age, huh, Sonny? A book for sex, you would be a prophet. <laughs> <laughs> Aaron, there you are. I started talking to this girl since she looked like she was the team was with Team Star. Then she and her Pokemon came at me without warning. They were just battling it out. Who the fuck's this? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Don't you know who question mark, question mark, question mark is? Riri, I knew you'd be out here. Carmen? Are you okay? San Diego. You're not hurt, are you? I'm fine. Honestly, now get away from here. It's not safe. I'll take you over guarding the base, Riri. You should get back inside. No, I won't back down. I can't. Oh, Riri, you need to stop this. Until our big boss comes back, I have to protect all of you in the Saf Squad. And everyone else on Team Star, too. That's why you should get back to the base and rest up, even just for a little bit. As the boss of the squad, I, ju I, I just can't. Riri, please, I'm your friend. Listen to what I'm saying. Fine. I'll go. I'm sorry, Carmen. Hey, there's no way to sign off. Let me hear a, a hello hasta la vista from you nice and loud. This game is full of so many gay people. Ha! Hasta la vista! <laughs> hasta la vista! <laughs> I'm your opponent now, you two. Come on, I'll take you both down. Hey, cheese stick! <laughs> <laughs> I said the line that clearly oh. says, hey, cheese stick. Fuck off. What, you don't like being called cheese stick? <laughs> no. <laughs> Mr. White! No! Mr. White! <laughs> Jesse! We have to make more cheese sticks, Jesse! Jesse. The estrogen market's gone fucking wild, Jesse! Everyone's turning into cat girls, Jesse! My Pokemon and I are actually running on empty after the last battle. Sorry to spring this on you, but do you think you could battle this grunt alone? I could have said no and be an asshole. <laughs> Thanks, I'll be sitting over here on my hands. How convenient for you, Cavell. I'll protect Ray Ray with everything I have. You ready to battle? And here I come. Uh, <laughs> what? That intro. I 
can't stand the Team Star intro. Wrong, Hatchet. I just said. Oh, that was effective. What level are they? 54, and I just one-shotted them. Well, I mean, isn't that like 10 levels below your below your gator? No, there's 60. Oh, so si <clears throat> Oh, excuse me, six, six levels below. Now they're gonna be higher, because I sent out Gardevoir. Oh god, not Primate. Never mind. I mean, I think Gardevoir has a pretty good chance of winning against just the fucking grass. <laughs> primate, primate has small brain. Even if all I did was buy Riri a bit of time, that's fine. My job here is done, so I'll head back inside. Hasta la vista! I think he Hatchet... slowly turns around. Yeah. I think Hatchet hates that... Does Hatchet hate that voice I gave her? Uh, not particularly. Uh, I think it's just Arvin's voice that you just hate. Yeah. I take it you defeated the guard out front. That base is run by Team Star's fighting crew, the Saf Squad. Their boss, Aerie, is a skilled wrestler and coaches the whole Team Star in Pokemon battling. Of all the bosses, she's likely to be the most alert to hostilities after our declaration of war. She might try to stop this raid in its tracks by challenging you to the battle for anyone else. I love Aerie. I knew it. Tell me what happened. I didn't say a single word. She retreated? We're talking about the same Airy, right? Well, it seems there's nothing for it now but to attack the base head on. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of operation. Time to walk the Seth squad off the map. I said WAP instead of WIPE. That's not a word you should use. I don't even know what that means. Uh, oh. Ben Shapiro memes. I still don't understand. Uh, Cardi B song. You're- you're- I- What? Wet. Ass. It, okay, I can do it. In the wise words of Ben Shapiro, wet ass P word. <laughs> oh yeah, B Bookworm said that. Oh. You're all dirty minded. That's what it no, means. That's literally what it means. Well, I didn't know what the word meant. I, I thought I just made it up. Grow up and learn what euphemisms are. <laughs> Why do you sound like J. Jonah Jameson? I don't know who that is. Spider-Man? Spider-Man's boss? Oh, yeah, that guy. <laughs> I need you to get me more pictures of Spider-Man, Harry. Wait, Harry, what? Harry Harry Potter is now a photographer. He got tired of J.K. Rowling's bullshit and quit. Yeah. Understandable. You put me, it's like walks up to J.K. Rowling's desk. You put me under a staircase. You gave me a damn scar, and now you're being transphobic constantly. I'm done. I mean, the actor that played Harry is also te uh, yeah. He actually did that. Yeah. Did y'all hear about that? What? The actor who played Harry Potter spoke out publicly against J.K. Rowling. Yep. No. 
So in other words, Harry Potter, the 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 character, the guy, is based. Yep, always has been. And <laughs> gave me anti-Semitic bankers. <laughs> oh no, oh no, bookworm. Let's not talk about the bankers. <laughs> Or the fact that in the bank, the, the flooring, if I remember correctly, had the Star of David in the middle for everyone to see. Uh. Oh, wait, I need to heal Gardevoir. I just like a fuck ton of Jigglybuff. You're just a bunch of buff Jigglybuffs? It's Jiggly Puff. Puff. Jiggly. Yeah, Jiggly Puff and Jiggly Buff. Jiggly Buff is an evolution, if I remember correctly. They made a new evolution? Isn't that what the evolution is called? No! Yeah, it's Wiggly Tough. Yeah, Wiggly Tough. I'm a dumbass. Sorry. <laughs> I was about to say, where did you get Jiggly Puff from? <laughs> what were you saying? Wiggle, wiggly Buff? It jiggly buff. Jiggly buff. Oh my gosh, the guard chomp fucked him up. <laughs> it didn't even get hurt. Okay, so I t I typed in jiggly buff. And all I'm getting is images of Jigglypuff that are swole as fuck. Hey, real? What? Real and true. Aw, oh, pajama sharks are so cute. Oh, Lemon got hurt badly. Oh boy, Lemon. No, not Lemon. No, Chunk got defeated! No! What are these people? Monsters. Oh, pocket monsters. Ah! Ha ha ha! Ah! I want to die. Lemon got slightly hurt, but they're still keeping it in there. Don't say it like that! <laughs> Do not- Don't- what? Don't say it like that! <laughs> Lemon, go okay. attack the big fat guy. Okay, here's a question. Is Lemon a male or a female shark? I don't know. Yes. Can't you check? Lemon no. is yes. Lemon is yes. Lemon is lemon. What do you mean? Lemon you ate check? their gender. I can't check right now. I'm in the middle of a thing. Oh, okay. Lemon's gender is yes. Lemon ate their gender along with their breakfast. They were basically they... Lemon died. Their gender is dead. Their pronouns are was were. Basically, the thing I was going to say is the way that you said that sounds almost perfectly like shark re reproduction. Oh. She got hurt, but they're still keeping it in. Oh dear God! <laughs> Terrifying. If y'all don't know, the the, the mating habits of sharks are very interesting. You see, uh, sharks have uh, sharks and rays have this weird ass genetic quirk called tonic immobility, where if you flip them over, they basically enter a trance like state where they can't move, and this is used for mating because uh, skates and uh, like elasmobranchs, unlike most other fish, are uh. Uh, in vitro uh, fertilizers. So they have to do basically the same thing that we do to reproduce. They The males have claspers and they stick it into the lady. And then uh, but you see they're in water, right? So the male to keep keep, you know, doing the process has to bite onto the female. 
So, like, it ba basically any really big female shark that you come across is going to have a shit ton of mating scars. Great. The more you know. Flash cannon. I just hit a dog with a flash cannon. No. Die. Oh, fuck. Why did the dog use play rough? I am literally a fairy type, you dumb bitch. Oopsie, did you realize you're outmatched here? You did, like, you did 30 damage. Okay, Gardevoir does not do well with this gem. Oh. They got one-shotted. Oh, wait, you should have checked to see if Lemon was... They're male. male or female. Oh, they're male? Then why did they get hurt while they kept it? I'm gonna stop. Yeah, she's fairy type. And that explains why. Oh shit! Hit with hammer. 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 Hit. That, oh my god, that did half of its fucking health. Jesus Christ. That that hammerhead just phased into the ground. I don't think that's I don't think that's accurate. I'm fairly confident hammerheads don't do that. Hit with hammer. Hammer hit hammer. Hammer hit. Oh, hammer. it's the new hammer, uh hammer. Hammer. it's hammer, primate's hammer. evolution. Annihilate. How do you even get that thing? I saw I hit I did not know that that existed. I somehow wasn't spoiled for that fucking thing existing. What the fuck is that? Why did they think that was a good idea? Holy they gave a bunch of Pokemon evolutions that probably didn't deserve it. And then they just grow a globe on their head. <laughs> I searched Pajama Shark on Pinterest. Oh. And literally, one of the very first things I see is a, is a shark onesie. Lemon took oh. it like a champ. He took it like a champ. He survived. Let's go, Lemon. You're you're poorly named, but we love you anyway. Oh, no, we also Lemon gave you that name. <laughs> Lemon is about as well named as a, as as our uh, largemouth bass. Also, I just beat the, uh, the the twink. I just beat the twink up. So guess who has every badge now? Congratulations. You and, committed. And, uh, Lemon died. No! I guess, I mean, I know it's really, like, I know it's, like, the in thing for sharks to fucking die because of human actions, but can we not? Alright, Grand Inferno is gonna take revenge. Burning Gator. Aw. No, it's the little pajama shark. Oh shit, they're super effective at fighting. This might be a problem. I think my team is really weak to fighting. Seems so. What's good against fighting? Uh, well, it was psychic, but Aeris got one shot. -ed. Go the chunk! Oh, Primate needs to use Rage Fist, Rage Fist twenty times, then level up to evolve into Annihilate. Right, you have a new challenge. You must acquire and annihilate. Annihilate. The chunk died. <laughs> no. No. The chunk. Not the chunk. It's also a little fucked up. You know, the, and I a second 
stereotyping, it might help you out. Oh, sure. Oh, is he a ghost? Oh no, did leveling up kill him? It's ghost. Oh, oh god, he died. Leveling up killed him. No wonder he's so pissed. <laughs> I can't move first, so I can't even attack back. Then again, that's technically what also happened with Grand Inferno. Oh! In took it in! No! No! God damn it, Kill In's gonna N. die. In's gonna die anyway. Miss. Damn it. And died. We lost. I mean, they were at level 56 or something like that. I only had one Pokemon at level 60. <laughs> mm. Gotta train up now. Yeah. I got my ass handed. I think the food got here for some or something like that. I don't know, cause there's like oh. dogs barking. I'm about to find out who is the big boss of or used to be the big boss of Team Star. Well don't tell me. I won't. Could I be the worst human imaginable and look up uh, who used to be the big boss and then loudly announce it? Yes. You would be an asshole. No, I said, should I be that? And you said, yes, so I guess I'm going to do it. <laughs> Don't you it's not it really there. that surprising in hindsight. Like, it's it's a, it's a twist, most definitely, but it's also like, oh, yeah, that ma that, that makes sense, yeah. I'm still guessing it's the lady who's having us do this. Either that or... Could it be Penny? 